Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is your speaking and welcome to the introduction spoiler video for multiplayer game number 39. This short video will compose of two parts. In first I will introduce the game, settings and players. And in the second part I will do a short summary of the game. So if you do not want to know how the game ended, skip this video and go to the second position of the playlist where the actual game starts. This time I'm playing a six player free for all no quitters game. No quitters is a Steam group that gathers people who want to play Civ without people leaving on them mid game. The link is on my main channel page. Settings are quick speed, small size, fractal, ancient era start, 12 city states, and random civilizations. I got Spain. Other players in this game were. Gemma playing as Persia, Artek 2 playing as Cottage, Mr. Singh playing as Venice, NQ Tomax playing as France, and NQ Lucky Strike playing as Celts. Now, spoiler alert, second warning if you do not want to know how the game went, stop watching right now and go to the second position of the playlist. My starting location was pretty nice. I had several food resources and after initial scouting it turned out that I'm on the east end of the map with Caltech pretty close to the south and Venice in the west. I didn't find any wonders first but I did decide to grab a wonder close to Venice since he can't plant cities and plant overall four cities and work on National College as fast as possible. I was a little bit afraid about Cottage backstabbing me, but he was pretty peaceful. Same goes for Venice. Thanks to the peaceful times, I was just working on my science and economy as much as possible. Venice launched a sneaky plan against Persia. He used great merchants of Venice to buy two nearby city-states and used their army to conquer Persia. GG Gemma. I was not sure what to do. I planned a frigate attack, but was not sure which target would be better, Carthage or Venice. In the end, I decided to attack Venice, so he wouldn't have the time to regroup his army and prepare a naval force that will be that would be troublesome on the oceans for me, because basically the two other players were on landmass, so, well, they were not threatened by the fleet so much as I was, and on top of that, I was just the next closest target for Venice. I managed to secure Venice. GG, Mr. Singh. My land army moved towards Persepolis, and fleet started to move towards my second target, Cartridge. Cartridge has fallen. GG, Arctic 2. I finished over remaining Venetian cities, keeping only Venice and Persepolis. I went for public schools first to keep the scientific advantage and slowly moved towards artillery to prepare an assault on Celts. Preparations has been done. Though Celt took foreign legions from freedom ideology, my superiors numbers and technological advancement were overwhelming. I slowly began to break through Celt's defenses. After heroic defense, Celt's capital has fallen. GG Lucky Strike. After the fall of Celt, France has conceded GG Anki Tomax. GG, thank you for the game everyone. Thank you for watching and I invite you to the actual game that is on the second position of this playlist. Best wishes, yours out.